Hey everyone and welcome to or back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a little fall vlog. Sephora sale just started so I'm going to go and pick up the little store pickup order that I ordered. I ordered it at midnight so nothing would sell out. I'm going to go pick that up and then do a little haul. I thought I would start this off with a little get ready with me and just kind of talk about some products I've been loving. I already did my eyebrows. Now I'm going to go in with this Refi primer. I got this during the last four sale back in the spring and I've been absolutely loving this. It makes my skin really glowy and it also is just like a good primer. It makes my makeup last really long. I also like to go in with the Say Glowy Super Gel. There is none left. I'm gonna try to get out what I can. I'm also out of my foundation so I had to like take the lid off so I can just like pour it onto my brush. So now I'm gonna use the Kosas concealer. This is also kind of empty. I kind of have to like scrape it. Now I'm gonna go in with my Laura Mercier Loose Translucent Powder. I have this giant one that I got in a PR package. And then I have this little powder puff. I love this little powder puff. It just works really good for like applying the product under the eyes. Now I'm just gonna go in with some faux freckles. I kind of like to do this before my bronzer and everything because I feel like the bronzer, blush, all of that kind of just helps blend it out. Now moving on to bronzer, I'm just gonna use my Hoola bronzer. I'm gonna go in with my Dior blush. I got this last year, I really, really love it. Now we're gonna do some eyeshadow. I'm gonna use this Morphe palette, 9B. Bronze Babe is what it's called. I'm just gonna use this middle kind of orangey color. I'm gonna apply that to kind of like the crease of my lid. I did this the other day for my birthday and I really like how it looked, so I'm just gonna do it again. I'm gonna take this Glossier palette and there's like this shimmery bronze shade and I'm just gonna use like the tip of my finger, apply that to kind of like the base of my lid. And I really liked this when I did this the other day, probably just cause I don't really do eyeshadow that much. I'm just kind of avoiding my lash line so I don't get a bunch of glitter on my lashes. Lastly is the lips. I'm just going to line my lips with the Charlotte Tilbury Lip Liner in Pillow Talk Medium. Now I'm gonna use this Morphe Liquid Lipstick. I like this because it just gives my lips like a little tint, so I just use like a little bit of this. I think I'm gonna use my Dior Lip Oil, Lip Oil, Lip Glow Oil. I have this in Rosewood. That is the makeup look. I'm just gonna finish up with my hair and get dressed. I just got a big package from Naked, so I wanted to do a little try on haul before going to Sephora and continuing on with the rest of the vlog. They're gonna be doing a really big sale soon. I thought I'd show you guys what I got. I picked up so many cute winter pieces. I actually am partnering with Naked on this video. They gifted me all these pieces. Naked has a really great sale going on. They have 30% off everything on their site. They also have 40% off denim and dresses. They also have select items up to 70% off. This is their best offer, their best sale of the year. Year, so this is the best time to shop everything I picked up from naked is like super good quality really really cute very trendy Of course everything that I'm gonna be showing will be links below in the description at the very top of the description If you want to shop any of these pieces I'll have all my sizing details and links below first up from naked is this scarf. I think this is so cute I love these scarves. They're such a good winter essential. I wear these all the time They're great to just throw on with a basic tee like I have on right now You can wear them with like a sweater or like an oversized kind of coat. I just wear these all the time They're are literally like my favorite winter essential. I really love this one because it's just like a nice staple color. I feel like charcoal gray is a really hot color right now. Also, this one is really cozy and warm, but it's not like overly thick. As you can see, it's not like super, super thick. So it's easy to kind of like wrap around. Next is the sweater. I really, really love this sweater. It's so cozy. It's like the perfect kind of like winter sweater. So cute for like around the holidays as well. Like I think this would be so cute like around Christmas time or like even on Christmas. Like a turtleneck, kind of like mock neck turtleneck and it's a little bit cropped. Just love the style of this. I love the fabric of this. Next is this oversized teddy coat. I think this is so cute. It's like very oversized. I love that like oversized boxy look and this is so cozy and warm. Like it is ridiculously warm. I've been seeing a lot of like big boxy kind of like faux for jackets so I also feel like this is really trendy I want to do like a styling winter fashion trends video I feel like all these pieces would be in that next is this jacket I really really love this as well this is like my favorite style of coat to wear in the fall and winter the winter especially just like this long kind of like trench style coat I love that this one has a belt like I really like the ones that have the belt especially because it just gives like a more 
feminine touch these are just so easy to style you can just have like a basic tee underneath i love this color this like brown kind of taupe color i just think it looks so warm and rich and just so pretty for the winter time next is this coat it's a little bit similar to the last one but this is a little bit shorter i've been seeing a lot of these like short belted kind of wool style coats i think they're going to be a really big trend this winter i think this will kind of mix it up a little bit i think it's super cute lastly is just this black sweater it's so warm it's just like a nice kind of basic black sweater this one is a little bit more fitted so i think it would be really good for layering it comes in a lot of other colors as well that is everything that i got from naked thank you so much to naked for gifting me these pieces and partnering with me on this video like i said they're gonna be having a big sale on their website so definitely make sure to shop naked i'm gonna have all the links below in my description so if you want to shop any of the pieces i just showed they'll all be linked below this is literally their biggest sale so definitely make sure to check them out I have a grande ice pumpkin spice latte. I'm getting a Starbucks, a little fall drink, a pumpkin spice. It's so dreary and rainy out. It's only 39 degrees. I got a little warning on my car that there's ice possible because of the cold temperatures. Got my Starbucks. So good. I'm excited because this package that I've been waiting on just got delivered. It's this bag that I ordered. I have like this little work tote that I kind of keep my laptop, my hard drives, anything kind of like work related. I just keep in this bag kind of all in this one place and it's like easy to kind of move around. It's like very portable. I have this little bag from base, but it's like ripping. It's like completely coming apart on the inside. I literally use it every single day, but I ordered this bag and I actually remember seeing them when I was in France with my friend Josephine and her and her mom was saying that they love these bags. I actually had never really heard of them before I went. Like I, it's a popular brand, but I just never heard of them before. I thought they were really cool because they like, they fold it like really tiny. I didn't get one when I was there, but I've been seeing them all over Pinterest, all over social media. They're super cute, super trendy. I thought this would be a good like work tote to kind of replace my other one. So I ordered it online. I ordered the Navy. It just got delivered. When I get home, I'm gonna put all my stuff in there and see how I like it. I also ordered a little insert. I've been seeing those on TikTok. People put like little inserts in them. I'm super excited. I'm gonna unbox that when I get home and kind of just like put all my stuff in it. I just got to Sephora. I'm gonna pick up my order. Oh, I just ran into Kylie. I got my Sephora order. I also ran into my friend Kylie, which was so much fun. She was also getting her Sephora stuff for the sale. Picked up lots of good things. First up is the Say Glowy Super Gel. I used it this morning, and as you guys saw, I was completely out of it, so I got this. Just makes my skin very, very glowy and just gives it like a very nice finish. And then I also picked up the Refi Face Primer. It's like the Glow and Sculpt. It has niacinamide in it, I believe. I also used this this morning. There is literally none left in the one that I have. I'm really excited for this. This is the Patrick Top plumping gloss i believe this is a limited edition color for the holidays let's try this it's so gorgeous i'm excited i almost didn't order this i'm so glad i got this it is a little bright pink for me like what i normally wear i do really like it i think it's really pretty this is in stock you should definitely get it next is the hourglass ambient lighting palette and there's like different shades i got the leopard one first of all the packaging is really cool oh my gosh it's so pretty. Oh my gosh, it's so gorgeous. It's stunning. I'm very excited to use this. I was like reading the reviews and a lot of people said the colors in this are really pretty on the eyes as well. I actually went a little crazier during the sale than I thought I did. I also picked up the Summer Fridays CC Serum. It's like vitamin C and niacinamide. Those are like my two favorite things. I have some other Summer Friday serums that I really, really love. So I think I'm gonna really like this. Something in this bag smells so good. I think the bag next to it had like perfume. It smells so good. I like need to know what it is. I actually picked up quite a few Hourglass products. I don't think I really have much from Hourglass. I also picked up this scattered light glitter eyeshadow. But I saw this in a TikTok and I just was obsessed. And then I actually went into the store and tried this and I loved it. It's really pretty. I'd try it right now if I didn't already have eyeshadow on. I got it in the shade Smoke. It's just like this really pretty glitter just like to put on the eyelids. Kind of like what I use today. Lastly are just some restocks. I got the Hula Bronzer, Laura Mercier Loose Translucent Powder. I also got a Glossier Boy Brow and Clear. 
Mine is like getting kind of dry. That is everything I got from the Sephora sale. I also ordered some more of my foundations online. I already know what color and I don't like need it right away. So I just ordered it online. I did go a little bit crazy during the sale, but this is like the one time of year that I actually buy stuff at Sephora. The whole rest of the year, I don't unless I'm like completely out of something. This is like the one time of year that I splurge at Sephora. Now I'm just gonna head home. My bag came in the mail. I'm gonna unbox it or not unbox. I'm gonna open it up, get all my stuff in there. Here's what it looks like. These bags fold up really small and then they like expand to be like a little tote bag. I don't know if I'll be able to like get it like this again. Let's open it up. Oh, hope all my stuff will fit in there. I think it's really cute. Apparently they're really durable too. This is the large size. I'll like link it below. There's a two pockets. I did buy a little insert from Amazon. It's basically like this little felt insert with like a bunch of different pockets. It kind of helps the bag have like a nice shape also. Here is my old bag that I've been carrying for a while. It's from base. I'm just gonna see how everything fits in here. First are my glasses. I wear contacts and sometimes they'll just feel really dry. Always good to have a pair of glasses. I'm gonna put them in like a little pocket. The very most important thing is my hard drive. Can't really edit without this. There's like a little zipper pouch here. Laptop charger. I feel like I don't like this bag. I'm gonna put it in this pocket. There's like another little pouch kind of like in front of the hard drive and I'm going to put all of these other kind of small things in the actual built-in pocket of the bag. I'm going to put some contact like eye drops. I have some migraine medicine so I'm just going to put those in there. My AirPods are going to go in the other pouch. I love these little to-do lists from Poppy. I have a couple of them so I think I'm just going to put this blank one in there so I can always have a little to-do list pad with me and I'm just going to put that in one of these little side pockets in this middle section which doesn't have anything in it because all this stuff is on the side i'm gonna put my laptop i just have it like that that is pretty much all my stuff that i keep in there it's pretty heavy but this is what it looks like it kind of looks a little weird on the bottom i feel like this would be a really good like school bag work tote and you can like snap it closed too and zip it up the large definitely fits all my stuff let me know your guys' thoughts. So the other day for my birthday, I went to Anthropology and I did a little shopping. Of course, I did vlogs. I did pick up a couple things at Anthropology. I thought I would just do a little haul. The first thing is this little Christmas tree. How cute. I'm obsessed with these. If you guys watched any of my vlogs from last year during the Christmas time, I'm just obsessed with these. This one also has like a very unique shape, I feel like. I also got a candle. This candle smells so good. I actually don't own any candles from Anthropology. This one is so good. The scent is fir and firewood. This is like the best Christmas, like holiday winter scent. I love it. And the packaging is really cute as well. I also also got a little ornament at Altered State. It's this little ornament, it's like a little baby Jesus. I actually made one like this that looked just like this when I was a kid. It was like a little bean and then like a little piece of cloth. But it looked just like this. It was like a little mini version that I made when I was like five or something. This just reminds me of it. So it's like very nostalgic and I just think it's super cute. It's also just like a good reminder of what the Christmas season is all about. I also got these little earrings from Anthropology. They're like these little vintage inspired earrings. Like it is a couple days later, I thought I would pick the vlog back up. I'm actually taking some Instagram pictures. It is so cold outside. I have a sponsored Instagram post that's due and I have to get it sent in tomorrow. It rained all last week. Like it was so rainy and so cold every single day. I'm gonna try to be quick. I actually brought two different outfits where I'm at in this park. The leaves are like the perfect fall foliage. So thankful for my mom braving the cold weather and taking these for me. I got this lip gloss from the Sephora sale. Um, the Patrick Ta lip gloss. I actually, I already showed this to you guys. I am so obsessed with this this is definitely my favorite thing i got from the sephora sale so i'm just gonna put this on before i take the pictures this is my outfit i just have this cream sweater on this jewelry from brook in new york this jewelry is so cute i love it i've been wanting some earrings like this for a while so i'm really excited to be partnering with them i'm just gonna take these pictures then i'm gonna get a fall coffee today's actually halloween that i'm filming this i don't know i think it's gonna go up a couple weeks after i have like a whole week of scheduled videos i think i'm gonna get a coffee because the holiday drinks are coming out super soon so i just want to get like one more fall coffee before the holiday ones come out and i have a whole bunch of things on my to-do list today so just thought I would vlog. Let's go take the pictures. This is the park area. It's like really 
fall vibe. I got the pictures for the sponsored Instagram post and now I'm just gonna take some pictures in this second outfit. I think I'm gonna clip my hair back since I have this thick scarf on. I have this bag, which is really cute with it. It's from the Lux Rewind. She sent it to me to like take pictures in and stuff. It's like really cold and the wind is like not cooperative. I think I got at least one picture in this outfit, hopefully. Let's look through these pictures. Not me making this face in every single picture. It's a couple days later. It is November 2nd. Starbucks holiday drinks just came out today. Gotta pick the vlog back up and vlog just a little bit more. I'm gonna get a holiday drink at Starbucks. I have been counting down the days. I'm so excited to go and get the sugar cookie latte. This lighting is so bad. Can I have a grande ice sugar cookie latte? I was trying so hard to remember how I ordered it last year. Did I get less syrup? Did I do 2% milk? I think I ordered it right. I got the sugar cookie latte. I am so excited. Like, I literally cannot wait to taste this. Also, they were sampling gingerbread, oat milk, chai. I already tasted it, but this is good. The gingerbread definitely gives it a very Christmassy taste. Two drinks in one today at Starbucks. I love that. Oh, the cups are so cute. They already have like the Christmas cups. Let's taste it before my camera dies. I have like the gingerbread in my mouth. I almost feel like I need to cleanse my palate. And no, it's fine. Okay. Oh my gosh. It's so good. I genuinely cannot believe I'm saying this. I think this is better than the pumpkin spice. I'm obsessed with it. I love this drink. It's so, it's like on another level of good. It's like sweet, but you can taste the coffee. It tastes like Christmas. My battery's about to die. I think I'm just gonna end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Just kind of like a random couple days in my life. Definitely give it a big thumbs up if you did. And comment below something you like to do during the holiday season. Thank you guys so much for watching. Comment this emoji if you stayed until this point in the video. And I'll see you in a couple days for the next one. Bye.